So now I said that these two be there, they are competing on which is going to be my favorite, right? So let's just compare both of them and let me tell you what I like about this and what I like about this and which is actually my favorite. So both Nivea products, they both have vitamin C in them. This has Q10, this has turmeric. And in all honesty, I prefer turmeric. I like, I like turmeric. Turmeric helps with brightening of your skin. Turmeric has so many benefits. It's in my video, but it's in that Nivea video I made. And um, I don't joke with turmeric. You understand but on my body not on my face i don't use anything to turmeric on my face because my face is very sensitive so i don't jump with turmeric i love 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 turmeric now when it comes to fragrance mm, both of them has nice fragrance as well i think i will choose the fragrance of this one i will choose the fragrance of this one when it comes to moisture mm, this is more moisturizing for me this is more moisturizing compared to this then mm, when it comes to blending into the skin, this blends better. This disappears. This disappears. Am I making sense? This disappears. That is why this gives more moisture than this. So, and um, the defeating part, this has SPF. This does not have. There's no indication on this that there's SPF in it. So, I mean, this one will save you extra cash because when you use this one, you still have to get a body SPF. But when you use this one, you already have SPF in it. So it's your choice if you have to use an extra S um, an extra sunscreen on your body or not. So which is going to be my favorite? At least from what I've said, you, you already know the one I'm about to call, right? Oh, no, there's no favorite. It's a tie. But... The Nivea products I've used, all the um, Nivea body lotions I've used, I would always reuse them because they are good. Did I mention that um, due to the fact that I was exploring other um, body lotions and the rest, I, I, I got stretch marks on my laps. Not too bad, not too visible, but if you know me, you know that I don't have stretch marks at all because I'm not careless when it comes to body lotion, but... That particular, one particular cream caught me off guard. I actually didn't see that coming. So, but, um, since I've been using Nivea, my skin, the stretch marks have been fading off. Like I said, it's going to take time. It's not as if something that would happen within weeks or days. But the stretch marks are already fading off. I, I think I can show you guys. But I don't have the before picture. Um, before picture. I had it, but I deleted it some months back when I thought there was no solution to the stretch marks. 